In this video, we're going to present you how to create a custom line style so we can have a custom hand railing along this bridge. Well, first, it all starts with a cell library. I have one, I attach one, and I attach the special library in which I have this is the hand railing I want to place. So I will just place it on the screen and the natural scale, the natural angle. So just to help me, I'm going to just place a reference line where to attach it here along the bridge. Right here. So where to snap to the line at the proper elevation. So I'm going to attach the cell library, the cell right here. So just place it. And that's the cell. So let's concentrate on that. That's the cell. And also remember the snapping point of that cell. Somewhere right here. Okay. Now let's create the custom line style. Go element, line styles, edit and I'm going to create a new line style okay, a new line style that is contained in a resource file okay, where is that resource file contained? Let's see if I can find it here that resource file <coughs> is contained in this folder by default program data, Bentley, OpenBridge Modeler, Workspace system symbology and I'm going to create a new line style I can edit this one too you have to remember that you have to have the proper permissions to write into this directory okay, so I'm gonna create a new line style I'm going to find new and it's gonna be named let's call it 100 So now we need to create the line style. So it's two steps. Edit, I'm gonna create the stroke pattern. So the stroke pattern is how many times I want to repeat this cell. So if I measure this, is almost 720 meters, 720 feet. So I want to repeat this cell as I place the line every 720. So I will add here, say, every 720, I want it to repeat the same cell. So that is the stroke pattern. I'm gonna put a name here, step 400. And just for my reference, let's call it 720 feet. Okay, done. The next step is to create the point. What I'm going to repeat, I'm going to repeat that cell. So we need to create, even though this is a cell, I need to create a point on that line style. And to do that, it's almost creating a cell. So I'll go cell origin in the drawing task menu, I'll go cell origin and right there at the center of the post then I can go selection set and select just the cell and then I want to create a point and I'm going to name it 100 the point is created so now I say that the stroke pattern that I'm going to use is the 720. Right. Double check, double click here, 720. Good. Come back to point and say, <clears throat> I'm going to repeat that point, the hardware that I just created. Also, how I want to justify it. Seems kind of strange talking about a justification on a cell, but I want to place it right to the left. 
So snapping every left with no offsets, with no separation. Put it a new name, handrail. Point. Now I put a name to the line style. So create name. And it's gonna call it hardware. That's it. Done. File. Save. And then I have, as you can see here, I have my new hardware line style. So good. I don't need this. I just can delete it. Then I can come back to my bridge. Right? So now I can check my line styles. If it's there. And if it's not immediately, I may need to exit the file and come back again. Oh, right here. Now to test it, you can go place line, for example, using the line style, I can use the symbology, the weight, even the, the colors that I need. And that's my line style. You don't believe me that it's there? Well, it's there. So, like any regular line, I can just go and delete it. But now I can place it on the bridge. So, let's go top view. And then I'm going to use red. Now it's going to be color zero. And then just place the line. Now it's snapping to the proper places of the bridge. You can see? It's in 3D view. So now I just snap on the top of the deck. And then I go all the way to the edge of the deck. Be careful here what you're doing, dealing in 3D, because look, I can just go and snap to the wrong point and be like off, off the elevation. So this should be okay. And now I have my handrail. Now if I check it in 3D, Of the handrail. On the bridge. With all the details that I can just create depending on the cell. And that's all there is.